Hello guys and gals, and we have Indigo Park. It's I don't think my computer is quite able to handle this game, but we're going to try it anyways. Um, I will be up front. I, I'm not going into this game blind. I've seen several people play through this, but I also wanted to just go through some of the secrets. And we're going to go and see all the jump scares, which is the fun part. Um, so, again, I'm probably going to be gotten by some of the jump scares, but uh, let's get, get on into this. Um, uh, yeah, I'm... My settings are, like, way wank, way jank or something. I don't know. But anyway, so let's just... Uh, well, you can't really continue. See, I'm clicking it. Nothing happens. But And we're going to say, uh, yes. Overwrite. Please and thank you. I do have some information on this scene right here. If it loads. Okay. It's really chugging, but okay. Are you gonna work? It might not work. I'm. That might be an eventuality where it doesn't work. We'll see. It's really chugging. Oh, there it goes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, if the video was on screen, this was made in MetaHuman, by the way. And they used a lot of light layers on it, but. Basically, since this isn't working, I'm probably going to skip this. Okay. And we're going to skip that. Sorry about that. Um, but yeah, it wasn't loading anyways. So um, it is great music, by the way. We'll see how this works. It might not work on my laptop. We'll see. The Steam page didn't actually have any specifications except Windows. So I thought I could probably run it on this potato, but maybe not. Literally, if you check the Steam page under this game, it does say um, Windows. That's it. No specifications at all. Um, anyways, it's thinking. It's thinking again. Okay. All I can do is wait till it um, it loads. It will eventually load, I think. Right? Maybe it won't. We'll see. This is a game that is free to play, by the way. It's on Steam. You can download it for free. It takes 8 gigabytes, I think. You get the movie scene that we just missed. It's in the uh, the file folder, the program file folder, and also the credit scene is too, in video format. Um, hmm, this might not work. Okay. Maybe if I move the mouse around. Does that actually work? Maybe I, that's why... Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm getting a black screen. I'm clicking. It doesn't seem to do anything. If I hit escape, does that do anything? Escape doesn't do anything. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Um, okay. Hmm, let me try something. Um, okay. Oh, no, there it goes. Okay. Now it's kind of loading. Okay. Now it's working, kind of. Okay. Going really, really slow, but I think it'll catch up. Find a way into the park. Okay. Use Waz to move. Okay. Uh... Let me go, uh, can I hit escape now? Okay, I can. Okay, well, let's go options. I'm going to see what the settings are at. Uh, video quality. Borderless is fine. I can't really, I don't know how I get to the, oh, graphics. Here it is. 
Oh, okay. This is bad. We need to, uh, like, uh, at least do medium, 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 medium. Cause that was, that was an epic. Uh, I mean, I might actually need to go low on these. Um, is this, wait a minute. Affects the quality and complexity of real time reflections in game environment. No, reflections are turned off. Screen space re uh, reflections are based on what is visible on screen. Um, let's, what happens if we turn this down? Uh, we're going to turn off Lumen for now and try that. Um, we, then we go back. Okay. Apply changes. Yes. We'll see if this... Okay. Uh, resume. Okay. This isn't too bad. Okay, the sensitivity is way high. Um, so we're going to need to do something about that right now. Sorry again. I'm going to... Um, I think this has... Um, yeah, um, Pal... Pal World, um, things. Pal World, um, control scheme. Like this. Okay, it's E to pick things up. If I remember right. Oh, I'm stuck on a tarp. Yay, I'm stuck on the tarp. Let's pick up this Lloyd plush. Wait. Okay, found a collectible. Um, oh. We can jump, by the way. We can't jump over this fence, though, I guess. Okay, that's fine. No cutting in line. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay, pick that up. Um, oops. If there, if you were able to wall clip, there's um. An Iron Man type guy over here in the map says hi YouTube because he figured that people would this is um it's a picture of Molly but her head's kind of missing. We'll see if uh, if um the quality will improve. I guess not. Okay. Um I'll have to settle for um not having very good visuals, which is okay with me. Let's see if this um graffiti shows up. Yes, the graffiti shows up fine. Okay, and this is where we go in. Okay, let's go. I'm going to probably need to turn down the sensitivity a little bit. If we look up here, there's a gear. You can make it out, kind of. But there's a gear up there. It falls down when um, the time is right. When they open up that door and you walk up to the thing, then the gear drops. It's up there. Hello, Rambly. There. That's it, eight years. A little bit over eight years. Okay, let's turn the flashlight back on. Ooh, okay, let's go. E. Uh, E? Yep. Okay. Nice touch. The camera worked. <laughs> nope, it's actually Saturday. Yeah, but technically it is Saturday. But it's, he probably did that so that you would get the best rate, which is cool. Okay. It's shift to run. I know that already, but okay. Okay. It isn't. Yep. 
Okay, all we do is follow the cable. Well, we have to bypass the, uh, the line here. But the cable goes right inside this door. Oops, stuck on the geometry. Love it when that happens. And here we go. Right there. And E. Pick up the gear. And I'm running into a wall. Oh, and it's shift to run. Yeah, I know. It's shift to run. We won't mean be needing that for a while anyways. And let's go over here. Yeah, here we go. Now all the lights are on. And the music starts. Nice stinger there. The thing with this game is you're not really in any danger until basically the last part of the game. There's nothing that can actually kill you. There's Rambly. There's um, Molly. They are kind of really pixelated though because of my settings are so low. Um, over here is the Molly plush. You're going to find all the collectibles. Good. And we just go over here. Right here. Yep, the critter cuff. Yep. Okay. Nice. We have Finley here. Some Finley plushies, some Rambly plushies, some Lloyd plushies. There you go. Also, wait, we'll wait. Okay. Okay. There you go. I think I had to hit E twice. There we go. In just a minute. Over here we have Salem the Skunk. This is the first time that Salem the Skunk actually appears in the game. Uh, we also have Lloyd, um, Finley, and Molly. Uh, there aren't any Rambly keychains, but Rambly has plushes. So uh, The merch here is pretty cool, if you were able to see it, that is. It's kind of pixelated because I have to have the graphics setting so low. But Again, this game is free, so if you want to see the really good stuff, then you just have to download the game yourself. Uh, uh, E. There we go. And we go through. Uh, the, the head of the statue follows you, by the way. Like, if I go over here, then the head will still be following. Yeah, like that. So, anyways, there are no collectibles here. The only thing to do here is to actually just go. One interesting thing here is that there is pretzel dogs. I don't think it's going to show up, though. Yeah, it's not. It says pretzel dogs there though. There's the bird up machine. That shows up fine, so I, it must be a texture issue. And then there's a camera. When we go in here, then to turn around, we are caved in. There was a cave in. Now there are two restrooms here. There's the men's room right here. There's nothing in here, though, as far as I know. There's just nothing in here. Now, if we go to the women's room, which you should never do, unless you know you have permission or something, uh, you find a collectible, though, in this room. Let's go and pick that up. It's the Rambly action figure. Uh, e. Good. So far, we found all the collectibles. And there's one on the train ride, which we'll pick up. Um, there we find out about Molly, Finley, and uh, Rambly. The, these two that fell down are probably Lloyd and Salem, probably. That would be my guess. They're, I, those are the only characters I know of. And you don't really see much of Salem. Salem's like the antagonist, I think.
In the Veda version, there was going to be a pink arrow that pointed to this place, but they took it out and changed the, uh, the dialogue, actually. Um, anyways. Now, um... Now, if we turn around this corner fast enough, we'll see Molly. Or not. Molly was right here, though. It's the first time you see her. And he likes trains. I don't know if that's a re reference to the ASDF movie, or... I think it's also a reference because it's based off of Disneyland or something, and Disney liked trains. So it could just be another reference to Disney. This um, game draws heavy inspiration from um, Disney World and theme parks in general, but largely Disney World and Disneyland. Never been there myself, but um, I was going to have a friend of mine play it who, had, who would go to Disney, you know, like once a year or something and um, see how accurate it was. But anyways, we have the train right now. One thing we can do right away while we're on here. Okay, wait a minute. The flashlight is on, isn't it? Okay, yeah, it's definitely on. Okay. Okay. Oh, here we go. It's going kind of slower than usual, I think, which is fine with me. Um, one thing we'll notice here, I think someone said this was a reference to uh, the Mr. Toad ride. I don't know the real name of it, just that it had something to do with Mr. Toad. Um, is this, in, this picture right here of Lloyd and Rambly getting along, which they don't. I like the cactuses. The cactuses are cute. Cactuses are super cute. We'll see Molly up here. Yeah, um, I think that this is going so slow because my settings are so low. Um, with faster settings, this probably would go faster. But that's fine. This is where you meet Molly. The card out... The for the cutout of Molly, anyways. Now, there's a door over here. Okay, right here. But over there. I guess we can't see her, but. She's right over there. We'll see her, um... Right there. Oh yeah, there she is. Yep, so we saw her there. We didn't see her when we went around the corner of the, um train place but we did see her in that in that one okay up here are there's a dead seagull i don't know if that means anything or not but there is a dead seagull up here i think i have to wait for it to light up for wait a minute i'm gonna try something i'm going to go option and turn on the lumen and just see if it messes with things video okay i think it was graphics uh We're going to try this. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, yeah, that's better. Okay. Okay, so now we're here. Um, there are seagulls up there. There's a seagull over here. And there's a seagull over here that fell down. So I don't know if that means it's like dead or what, but there's a seagull down there. And now we meet Finley, I think. Some of the lines here in this next dialogue are really interesting. Maybe I'm just reading too much into them, though. It's probably so. It's probably what it is. Oh. 
Yeah. Okay. And these are kind of cool, especially since some of these are some of them are smiling. That one is grinning like a shark. Yep. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. That's kind of sad. Finley's the cool, probably one of my favorite characters, Finley. Anyways, um, now we get the, um, a little bit of a jump scare. Because this area is really torn to heck, so you basically know something's going to happen. And there's blood on the ground, which is mysterious because the park closed eight years ago. And the blood is still fresh. I don't know. It would have been a. It would have dried by now, you would imagine. And then there's Salem's standee. We'll call it a standee. They call that them that in um, Mario Wonder, the standees. Um, someone had cut the standee in half. And I don't think Rambly is able to do that, so I don't know who had it out for Salem and cut down the thing. Okay. There you go. That's it. Okay. This is where the other collectible is. Yeah, get the bat, the train back up and running. Over we over here we have um, Salem the Skunk. What we do is we go back here. Go right here. There's a jump scare right here. Hello, Molly. Um, yeah, anyways, the collectibles right here, the ears here, he picked that up. Um, we need some gears, you know where the gears are, Finley? I know where the gears are, there's one right here. Let's go ahead and pick that up, and there's one on the, the, uh, the thing, the shelf over here. Good to see you, Finley. I think these are the old animatronics they used to use. Not na and the, the old suits, I would say, or the the old um, because they re they replaced the mascots, and the mascots are now flesh and blood instead of mechanical or so something. Okay, and we just get back on. The, okay, we did get the uh, we did get the collectible, so that's good. Uh, Did I not do something right? Did I not? I might not put all the, the cogs in. Because something's not working right. Okay. Yeah. Um, I know we can run. Okay. Oh, I didn't put the cogs in. Duh. Okay. E. And E. There we go. Put the cogs in. There we go. Hop back on the ride. Okay, we jump. Hopping back on the ride. We get to do the bunny hop. Okay, let's go this way. Oh. Where's the shift key? Oh, there we go. Now there's another jump scare over here. A lot of people miss. Ugh. Okay, now we go into Lloyd's area. Yeah, here we go.
There we go. Almost there. This is Lloyd's area. And um, this is an interesting one. Assuming what we learn about Lloyd later. There we go. That's Lloyd. But we're more interested in what's back here. Right here. Right there. Yep, that's, um, next time we see Molly will be in Lloyd's Theater, I believe. And, uh, that's it. I think that the, the train ride ends now. Um, we see something interesting on the picture thing here in a little bit. It's actually running pretty good for, on my laptop. I had to turn the settings way down, of course, but, um, I'm okay with that. So we just go and, uh, there we go. And Lloyd. And up here, we see um, that um, Molly was following us the whole time. I'm running fast, too. Um, okay, what I wanted to do was see here. Interesting. These are actual... Um, Actual checkout things. I want to take a close look at those. Okay. Um, anyways, the merch here is pretty cool. Um, there's tails. Those shirts are pretty cool. Indigo Park shirts are neat. And there's an actual Ramblay plush, and they've sold about 5,000 of them at the time of making this. They've literally made about. They've literally sold 5,000 of them, and they're $30 each. Um, also, I want to point out. Well, we walk here. Um, it sure is dark, but... Oh, here we go. Um, okay, there's Lloyd's Theater. We don't want to go in there yet. We want to get the um, other collectibles first. One of the collectibles is in the Café... Over here, Café de Raton Lavier, a.k.a. the Raccoon Café. So let's go in here. In the beta, going in here would activate um, something on down the way. Okay, let's pick up this Rambly Cup. Good. Um, after this, we should have only be missing four. And over here, we're going to get the uh, thing. He's going to say, come over this way. We'll come over there later. Sorry. Sure thing, Rambly. I just have to do something first. The golden Rambly plush is in here. E. Got it. Okay, so now we have, I think, I'm going to check, but I'm pretty sure that we have every collectible up to this point so far. We should be missing four. Two of them are in game, and. Um, let's see. Two of them are in the, are in the landing. Um. Here it is. Yep, we're missing one, two, three. One, two. Yeah, one, two. Oh, I forgot to get the, the Rambly plush. Oops. <laughs> I missed the Rambly plush at the very beginning of the game. Oh, well. Um, it was in the room with the generator. Oh, I forgot to pick that one up. But we can do this. Uh, e. Uh, the Rambly Cup. Okay. Uh, we have this one.
That's um, capitalism. Chapter two, you do. Um, and we missed uh, this this one. I know where it is. Uh, another playthrough, I could probably get that. If you can find everything at yard sales, that's where I find my consoles usually. Um, so now we go over here, or we can run, I guess, find the shift key. Where's the shift key? That's control. Oh, there's shift. There we go. Mm-hmm. Orange access granted. And there that little flourish that we'll go over that a little bit later. Um oh here's the shift key. Okay. I think it's this way. I'm taking a guess. Okay, yeah. Um, it's over this way. There it is. Here we go. Now we meet Lloyd. This game is really good at subverting expectations. This is a huge theater, and normally it would be lit up really nice, but um, again, my laptop is really limited in terms of... Okay, and there's Lloyd. There he goes. Got up and he left. Mm -hmm. So anyways, let's just uh, go up the stairs then. And we'll talk to Rambly. That'd be an interesting feature. I'd imagine it would be nanotech nanotechnology. Player piano. That's a secret that some people miss. Now there's something interesting that happens here. No don't, don't know since my stuff is so limited. I will see if I can see everything here. But um Lloyd is over here. Let's see if we can see him from here. Right from inside the door. Yeah, there he is. Can't see him very well, but there he is looking at us. Now, if we were to turn around, we'd see Molly right there with the stinger. Yeah, Molly. And then there's Lloyd. Now, if we walk towards him, he leaves like that. He's just like, well, I'm just going to shove off. And um, so there's no need to actually hurry. We're just going to sprint anyways, you know. There is a lot of tension here, but nothing actually happens to you. So um, I'm just running because there's not really any need to wait. Up here is a is a scare is a jump scare, right here. Hey Lloyd, good to see ya. Better luck next time, Lloyd. But that has to happen so this way can open up. So we're just gonna run, not because we're scared, but basically because. Um, Okay, and then this way. Okay, I'm just finding my way through this linear path. It's meant to look like a maze, but there's really only one way through it. So basically, you anticipate a chase, but... Um... Okay. Uh... Okay. Okay, uh, let me hit F. Oh, here. Can I see the... Uh... Does it light up? I need to pick up those keys. Oh, here we go. 
Now Lloyd's going to start stomping around, but that's just intimidation tactics. Yeah, we'll run because, oh, just because we can. Nothing to really be afraid of here. Oh, wait. If I remember the linear path. Uh, okay, yeah, this is the linear path. Okay, uh, running, I go a little bit too fast, so we're only going to use shift sparingly. You have infinite stamina, by the way. But, um, okay, here we go. And if you jump just right, then uh, you can basically make that and get there. But anyways, we go up here, and then we get another jump scare. Here. And then we get a jump scare. The uh, critter cuff emits a sound, and Lloyd runs off. Oh, why was my flashlight off? Oh, well. Oh. Uh, and normally if you were coming back, you would see that Molly was watching you, but we've already gotten that jump scare out of the way. So there's nothing here. Now all we do is leave. So we got the key. There were no collectibles in that area. Oh, might as well um, run. Uh, we need to go this way. We've already gotten all the collectibles in this area. I missed the I missed the Rambly plush, which is in the generator room in the first the first area. But um, that's okay, I guess. Now we have the key to Jetstream Junction. Also, he did mention, the creator mentioned that um, this area, the shop of photos, was going to be something where you could take photos and stuff, but it was just going to be extra stuff that was just taking up space, so he decided not to. Also, um, I do want to note um, something here, uh, something interesting. Over here, someone asked him during, during a, okay, wait a minute. Over here, this building here, about why it collapsed. As you can see, this building is really torn up. And so someone asked the creator of this game why that building was all torn up. And he said that, um, I can't use the language here because um, this is a no swear channel. But um, the creator said that um, he pooped and it broke the building. So um, there's that. Let's go into Jetstream, Jetstream Junction. Okay, here we go. Okay. Sounds good. Now well, we're going to run a little bit. Um, first things first, though, there is a collectible. Okay, Molly's Garage doesn't really have anything, but if we go back here... There is a collectible in this game. I don't think we use the mouse for this. I think that this is this is a platform. We're probably going to be terrible at this, actually. Oh no, Molly's plane crashed somewhere in Rambleberry Woods. I better find her and make sure she's okay. Uh, oh, it's, it's Wasp to move. Okay. And we can jump. Oh, you have to hold it in. Okay. Okay, so I'm, I'm not going to be using the arrow keys. I'm used to using the arrow keys, so this is going to be interesting. Oh, this is going to take a little getting used to. So bear with me here. I know. Molly's playing Crash somewhere in Rumble Bear Woods. Better check on her and find out she's okay. 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 Uh, we, we don't really need to get all these. I'll get all of them that I can. There. We need to kill that squirrel. I didn't mean to kill it. Oh, boy. Wow, that was close. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. 
I need to get a running start. Okay, wait. There we go. Oh, uh-oh. Okay, we're gonna catch, we're gonna get all these. There are 39 berries total. Ooh. Oh, and I fell off. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so I have to keep in mind that this is completely ASDF. I'm more used to using the arrow keys to move, so I wish that that was the case here. I know WASD is the, is the go-to way of playing these games, but there, that was better. Uh-oh. Sorry, squirrel. Oh, there, okay. Oh, well, uh, I, he, he got me last time, too. That's fine. We're doing a little bit better this time, though. Double jump. Since it gives you a double jump, it's, it's cool. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, that was close. There's some squirrels in love. I guess that even though they got hit by Salem's potion, they still are able to um, feel love. It's kind of interesting, actually. Okay, so how many do we have? 30. Okay, we missed nine of them. No, actually, we missed um, four of them because I got hit once. So that cost us five, which is fine. Okay. Okay, yeah, this is fine. I think that, yeah, now there's no way to die. Oh. Okay. That texture didn't load for me. Okay. Molly, what happened? Ugh. Hey, Rambly. I was flying through the woods, but suddenly I couldn't see a thing. Salem, looks like my smokescreen made her crash right on target. Salem, I should have known it was it were, you were behind this, you shady skunk. Let her go. Nah, how's about I try my new potion on her instead? I'm tired of wasting it on squirrels. Molly, look out! Oh, now she's purple. Too slow, dumpster face. Well, what did you do to her? Meet the new and improved Molly McCall. Now with more, uh, now with none of that friendship garbage stopping her from tearing you to pieces. I wonder what she really thinks of you now. Have fun finding out. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, Ooh. I got her once, I think. Okay, wait. I'm gonna wait. I have to wait. Oh, there we got her. Okay. Ooh, she's still jumping. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Did I get her? Nope. Oops. I lost. <laughs> Here I thought there was no way to lose. Um, I'm gonna have to try and get more of the berries, I guess, or try not to. Um, this gets you a uh, collectible, so. Ooh. You have kind of a floaty jump. Okay. Ooh. Okay. There. Okay, now I'm gonna make sure I don't hit, get hit by the squirrel again. There we go. Okay, we just had to do a regular jump there. Okay. And then I think we just walk off. No, we don't just walk off. We'll skip that one. As long as we get the majority of these, that's fine. Okay. There's the squirrels in love again. Okay, we got 36 of them this time. We only missed three, which is way better. That means we still have um, most of our hits, which is good. Um... But 39 is the max. 
So it would technically be, technically be 40. Almost fell off there. Um, with the berry you get as the end reward. Oh. Uh oh, that was close. Okay, I need to be playing better. Okay. okay. We need to get up here. And now we just need to... Do -do. I guess I just need to double jump less. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Then up we go. Molly, what happened? Yeah, okay. I was flying through the woods and suddenly I couldn't see and then, yeah. I think if I just jump straight up while she jumps, I think I can get a, get off a free hit or two. I'll try it. Nah, how's about... I try my new potion on her instead. I'm tired of wasting it on squirrels. This could be an indication of what actually happened to the mascots in this place. Maybe why Rambly can't get near Salem. Well, I'm call yeah. Have fun finding out. Yeah. And actually, had I... Ooh, she's Naruto running. Okay. Ooh. There we go. Got her. Okay, took a few tries, but at least we got it. And then we have our little, oops, wait. Wait, you can you can actually use the arrow keys? Wait, that's cool. Uh, oh. Okay, um, oops, I need to be using W. Okay, so there is another collectible. Okay, jump, thank you. Um, and it's, um, up here, rooftop races. Uh, yeah, right here, rooftop races. Oh, was my flashlight not on? Oh, well, I guess it is. Okay. Now, if we go down, we find the Percy Poodle plush. Over here. Right there. E. Okay, so we got both of the... There should only be two collectibles left. Since I missed one, it's three. But I do know where that one is. But anyways. So now what we do is we go up... Okay. Actually, there's something I want to try. The creator said he left something in the game. And I want to try it. Uh, I don't want the landing pad. Let's go... I think it was the garage. Yeah, Molly's garage. Now, um, there's a plane up here. We're going to try and get on the plane. I'll give it a try anyways. Nope. Okay, the plane's over here. Now, supposedly, you're able to get on the plane. And maybe not. It's something they might have patched out. After all. Oh! I thought I was up on the railing. They might have fixed the jump mechanics too, so you can't really get on the plane, but uh, in the beta, you were able to get up on the plane. I guess you can't now. But that's okay. There is not really anything here, but there is something... Okay, there is something here. Something really interesting. Okay, just jump. Thank you. Um, these showed up pretty nice. These make me hungry, by the way, and it's two in the morning so I can't really get a burger but there's build your own burger there's a loaded hot dog and there's the chicken sandwich all those look really good um, if we go up to the bird up machine then there's um, this is it now this one if you go to the bird up vending machines you'll find these bird up um, Kohler well that's diet Kohler actually 
there's um, water, there's Dr. Muncher, there's regular Kohler and diet water. Over here we have, these are basically homages to other people. There's Lyric Rect, Lyrical Rect, there's um, Yeah. Astral Blast. Oh, that that one is one of them was Neutron something or another. Neutron Blast. But there's oh there's so many different sodas there. And they're all like they pay tribute to people who have actually contributed to the game, which is pretty cool. Um oh. Let's just get a move on here. Um, let's see. Uh no, not there. Rooftop races. Okay, let's go talk to Rambly. That way we can get to the next part. I don't know how the chase scene is going to go. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> okay, uh, shift. Oh, did I miss it? I think I missed it. Oops. Yeah, it's right here. And right there. E. Nice. Loading screen. Okay. Um, there's a purple star on the wall. That means this is purple star. There you go. I already know the code, but we're going to go over all the jump scares anyways. If we go here, then we'll see Molly running up there. Okay, let's go this way first. There is a jump scare up here, too. This is where the yellow circle is, or and a Molly jump scare right there. She left some blood behind, dripping from her beak, and then there's the yellow circle. Then we just fall down the pipe here. Bop. Oh. There we go. Okay, that means we go this way. And we go this way for the other ones. It's yellow circle, red star, blue star, green triangle. Red star is over there, right there. Right there is the red star. Now we just hit this. There we go. Jump across. Go in here. I don't think there's a jump scare in here. Wait. Oh. And over here is way to look down. And here's Molly. Nope, I was wrong. Green triangle. And then Blue Star. That's where all the answers are. And then there's Molly. Hey, Molly. Now all we have to do is we'll go down the slide. We'll jump out the ball pit. There we go. So we go Blue Star. Blue star, this is yellow circle. Uh, green triangle's right, and now what we do is make this a red star. 
There we go. And that opens up the door up here. Okay. Then loading screen. Okay, now I don't know how this is gonna go. Um, we don't need to jump, so I don't need to use a space bar. So I'm gonna have to hold down shift and then move the mouse. But anyways, here we go. We'll mosey on up here, hit E to open the door over there. There we go. Uh, yeah, there's the door. Now we get the chase scene. We walk up to this door. Okay. We can get shift ready. And then go. Okay. Then we go this way. Run. Through the pipe. Oh, then we go through this pipe. Okay, Molly. Oh, she got me. I think I got stuck on the architecture. But we get a nice little cutscene here. I mean, a little uh, kill screen. The art on this is pretty cool. Uh, on the death screen, rather. Yep. You're caught by Molly McCall. Molly can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. Yeah, then E to respawn. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Um, like I say, this is going to be really interesting. Um, I'm basically going to hold shift and W the whole time and move the mouse. So, yeah, I think I got stuck on the architecture there. Uh, let's see. Uh, we open the door with that. Go down here. Run. You can run up to the door. Okay, that, now it's opening. Let's run. Run. Okay, we go here, then we go through here. Ugh. I'm stuck on something. Oops, I got stuck again. Whoops. <laughs> yep. Ooh, did I hit E too soon? I might have hit E too soon. Okay. That's fine. There we go. Um, we'll try this. Um, yeah, I keep getting stuck in that pipe. Um, I just need to be a little bit better. Maybe I need to maybe lay off the gas. Maybe not run quite so fast. Uh, okay. Uh, e. There we go. Go down here, and then... So, let's see. We can go bop. Okay. I know that's going to work, because that door is shut. So we go this way. Okay. Here, quickly, quickly, quickly. Okay. Ah, stuck again, stuck, 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 stuck. Okay, ah, this pipe is terrible. Okay, we go, now we just hit this. Good, go straight. Then we go up and around. Yeah, okay. Oh, no, 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 we go this way. That's right, always take lefts, we always take lefts. We are always taking the lefts. Okay, now with this one we uh, hit and then go around. Nice. Now we go this way. We don't worry about but there, that jump is impossible. We go down. Hope we don't get stuck on anything. Good. We go this way. Run, 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 run. Then we turn, turn, we turn. Go up here. This time we go straight. Then we go turn. We go up like this. We go up like this. We go up like this. Ooh. Oh no. Am I stuck? I'm stuck. Uh oh. I'm stuck. Oh, no, there we go. Okay, here we are. I would get that collectible, but I don't think that I actually want to do this. Oh, she still managed to catch up to me. I think I got stuck on something again. We did better that time, though. So that's good. That is the right way, though. That's the right way to go. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we almost made it that time. I know all the directions to go. It's just executing them in the right order. So um, what we can do here. Okay. Okay. Do that. 
Okay. Gonna keep shift pressed. Rep the door. That should be good enough. Okay, then we go through here. Go through here. Hopefully we don't get stuck this time. Okay, All right. I, am I stuck? Okay, I think I'm stuck this time. Okay, there we go. There we go. Hit this as hard as we can. Good, we jump all the way across. Nice. We go here, whoop, turn around, boop. Go here, go through here. Go here, go straight ahead, straight ahead, straight ahead. There's another another bounce pad here. With that, we go bounce, go around. Oh, go here. Don't worry about that. We go here, this way, we drop. Good, that was a perfect drop. Uh, keep going straight, and then we get ready to turn here. Good. Up, go straight. Up here, then around, then around again. Uh oh. Did I get stuck? Oh no, I got stuck again. Okay, quick getting stuck, please. There we go. Yeah, there's a collectible right there. Uh, okay, let's just keep running. Oh! She still managed to catch me. I get stuck up on that one section, and that is, um, that's kind of bad. Um, I need to find, okay, I need to lay off the gas when I do that. Okay, yeah, it's E to respawn, okay. Yeah, don't be fooled. I need to lay off the gas. I think when I do that, I need to not hit the shift button so I don't hit the wall, and then I can just drop. Yeah, 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 yeah. That'll work. Okay, let's just, uh, uh, here it is, E, go over here, that opens this metal door right here, and we're going to just basically hold down shift. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, run, then we go, boop, this pipe is kind of kicking my butt, it's kind of... There we go. Okay, we jump across. Okay, let's get ready to whoop, do this. Whoop. Oh, hey, there we go. Okay, then we go this way. There's another jump pad right here. And then let's go bop and around. Whoop. Then we go drop this way. Drop. Okay, that was a perfect drop right there. If we could just do that with the last one, I think we'd be fine. We'd get enough of a head start to... Oh, straight ahead. Good. Now we are almost to where we were, but there's another drop up here that always causes a problem. Okay, we're not going to... Okay, drat. I, I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. Oh, no, there we are. Okay. Okay, let's go this way. Flat out sprint. Flat out sprint. Run faster. Okay, hmm, <laughs> yeah, um, I don't know why, okay, yeah, she does speed up at that area, I do know that much, okay, yeah, I know. I do like that art, though, that, that is really cool art. So let's see. Yeah, I get stuck on the architecture. I think if I didn't get stuck on the arch... No, wait, she does speed up at that point, though. So, anyways, let's just try again. There we go, that's close enough. So, anyways, we do... Actually, all we have to do is hit... Um... Oh, wait. Let's go this way. Okay, that should be enough. We go this way. Yep. Okay, then we go through here. Okay, this pipe is extra curvy. But I'm getting better at this pipe. I'm getting better at this pipe, I think. Run, 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 run. Straight ahead, straight ahead. Good. There we go. Hit this. Run. This. Do this. There. Okay, there's another little jump pad here. Ooh, she's right behind me. Okay, we just drop. Drop. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Good. And that was that was a perfect perfect drop. I don't just don't know why I can't get the perfect drop on the um, the other one. Okay. Straight ahead. Blue is always straight ahead. I think. 
I remember, right? Then we go up here. Then we go up here. She speeds up. Okay. Oh, okay. I got stuck on the wall. That's not great. Okay. That was a good drop. Uh, that was a good drop. That was a good drop. Okay. Now this is where she speeds up. This is where I get usually get caught. Okay. Now we're in the now we're in the vents. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Let's go this way. And this way. This way. This way. This way. Straight ahead. I know it's. Okay. Here we go. Okay, now we just turn around and watch the cutscene. Oh boy. Well. <laughs> then okay This gives us a time frame. Um, trademarked the last 10 years, and it's been eight years since anyone's been in the park, meaning the, the park opened two year, was open two years before the mascots went, went wild. Apparently, because of the, because, yeah. Oh, no. Okay, so if we go up here, we get one of the collectibles. I know I missed that one during the chase, but... There. <laughs> okay, so, um... Yeah. Oh, wait. So here we have the, um... Security cameras. From places that we've been. Might be a Five Nights at Freddy's reference, I don't know. But that's pretty cool. Um, let's see. There isn't really anything along here. There's stuff over there, but we've got all the collectibles, or we know where all the collectibles are. I'm just not really good enough to get that one during the chase. Um. But if we uh, go here, then we have the, uh... Percy's Playtime, yep. Okay. Uh... Uh, also, we got this one. <laughs> yeah, uh, this is a reference to um, 
day shift, I think, where they talk about Vegas and um, old sport. This is, um, yeah, this was at the in the very first room, but this one was during the chase, and I couldn't navigate my fingers to hit the E button while I was doing the running thing. But anyways, oh, turn the flashlight back on. We see Finley here um, briefly. Um, let me just run. Here we go. Okay. Now. There is, there is Finley. Okay. And then we get the end credit scene. Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Yeah. Oh. Oops. Oops. Yep. Rambly review, yep. Okay. There is a stark contrast. Everything that this place should be. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure why the videos aren't working. Okay, I don't know if I'll be able to... If it's, I don't know if it's going to be a white screen. Um, hmm. Oh, here we go. Uh, resume? I, since this didn't load, I'm not exactly sure that I can actually get out of this. But anyways... I will do something else while, while I'm here. Let me go ahead and um, do some stuff real quick. We're going to alt tab out of this. Um, so give me a second. And we're back. I'm here on their Kickstarter page. I do want to... Okay, sorry. Oops. Uh, right here. 
we were on their Kickstarter page, and they've already made their initial goal was fifty thousand, and they've made one hundred eighty-four thousand seven hundred sixty-seven with three thousand two hundred ninety. Seven backers, and there's still 19 days to go. I do plan on supporting this. Um, Indigo Park is a free game, and I think it's worth a lot more than being free, for sure. Um, now, just because they've reached their goal and they've tripled their goal doesn't mean you shouldn't donate. You should actually donate because they can make Chapter 2 even better with more funds. Um, um, yeah, it was completely free. Oh, and on Itch.io, too. Um, this goes basically into the creator. This goes into all this. But it also goes into um, the rewards. Um, you can, okay, the early bird digital copy is out. Um, there's some of the, these things that are... Um, oh, here. That are completely sold out, which is fine. Um, ooh, does I... Wait. Okay, here we go. Let's go all the way to the top here. There's a physical art book. There's um, custom voice acted line. There's the physical OST, original soundtrack. And um, the ultimate bundle. Okay. Are they sold out of the... Oh, no, here. I do at least want to do this, the a digital copy of Chapter 2. I will be doing that at least, and I might I might donate it even more. I don't know. But I do. I know I do want a, an advanced copy of Chapter 2, just because the game is awesome. Um, so, yeah, if you do have the money, you should really support this project, for sure. Um, but, yeah. Um, this is a really fun game, and it's free on Steam, um, so make sure you check that out. Even if you're not really a fan of Mascot Horror, this is still a really good game. Um, they did a wonderful job on it. Um, they've worked on the game for a little bit over a year, if I remember right, and um, you can tell that a lot of passion went into it, so make sure that you support them. Um because this is a this is a product this is a project that's worth backing for sure. Um, when you have this kind of dedication and um, passion, then um, good things are bound to happen. Um, oh, the digital art book so is seventeen dollars. Hmm. I might do that. I was thinking of spending twenty five dollars, and this would basically be. Um, hmm. I might. Because to me, this is this game is worth more than being free. I mean, a, if a AAA comp company would be release a game like this, they'd probably charge like twenty or thirty bucks, literally. Then again, AAA companies come up with games like the Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League. But um, less we say about that game, the better. Um, anyways, um, this game is worth backing. And as I say, I and as I've said, I will be backing this as well. Um, when I get a little bit more money, I will be backing this. I still have 19 days, I think, to back this. And I definitely want a copy of Chapter 2. Just because this is a game I really like. I'm probably going to play through it again. Um, but yeah. Um, anyways. Anyways, that is going to... Uh, I do realize that the... Uh, camera wasn't on. Okay, let's fix that. Um, anyways, that's going to do it for this video. If you like this content, make sure you like and subscribe, ring the bell so you know when I upload. Also, if you want to support me in any way, or if you want to join the Discord server, all the information will be in the description below. And as always, thanks for watching, everyone. You are loved, and have a great day.